What is up guys? Prodigy here. And I got you guys all the new perks coming with the new Titan subclass called the Sunbreaker. If you guys are interested in seeing the other new subclasses for the Warlock and the Hunter, make sure you drop a like on this video. Right before I get into the subclass, I want to go ahead and thank Son of Seth over at Reddit for making this post. But uh, here we go. Starting with the grenades. For the first one, we have fusion grenades. And this one works exactly as it does with the Warlock. For the second grenade, we have match grenade. And this one explodes and sends a burning line forward along the ground doing damage over time. For the final grenade, we have incendiary grenades, and this one works the same way as for the Hunter. Moving on to the jumping perks, all of these are all the same for the Titan. We have lift, increased height, increased control, and catapult. These haven't changed, they're the exact same jump for the Titan. On to the super perks. Starting with the first one, we have Hammer of Soul. This means Hammer of the Sun. Here you summon a flaming hammer and just wreck destruction in front of you. Next we have High Moon. Here you can throw your hammers and the more health you have, the more hammers you can throw and the bigger the impact will be. Next perk we have is Sun Charge, and this is very similar to Shoulder Charge, but you don't really need to sprint. You just press your right bumper, your R1 bumper, and you'll just do a flaming Shoulder Charge, destroying anything in front of you. Next we have Conflagration, and in this one it says that you ignite the world, creating sunspots where your Hammer of Soul impacts. So wherever you throw your hammer, gonna leave a big old sunspot and supposedly it's gonna ignite the world moving on to the melee perks for the Titan for the first one we have Sun Striker and this one ignites your enemy with a heavy strike second one we have is melting point and in this one it says you can burn away your targets defense and the target that you choose will take more damage from you and allies so I think when you melee this character, you give them some kind of poison, some kind of shield, some kind of fire, that you burn away their defense, and then after you burn away their defense, they take more damage from you and your teammates. Next off, we have Fulminator, and I believe this is very similar to the Sunslinger's uh, melee. Well, Sunstrike will release a solar explosion on hit, igniting enemies with the blast so it's gonna leave like a little burn damage after you melee them at least that's what i'm getting out of it moving on to the last perk for the melee tree we have stoke of the forge and this one reduces the cooldown of your sun striker and getting a kill with your sun striker will instantly recharge it and if you don't know what sun striker is that is the first perk we went over and that is your melee ability moving on to the passive perks for this subclass we have fleet fire Enemies killed by your fire grant you a bonus agility and reload speed for a short time. Next we have tempering, grenades, and melee cooldown is faster when your super is full. So if you like to use your melee ability, you like to use your grenades, and you want it to, to, to cool down quickly after you use them, don't use your super. Make sure your super bar is full. Moving on to the final perk, we have Wreath and Flames, and this one, Hammer of Soul, last longer and you gain an overshield when standing near a sunspot so we are on the final set of perks this is also a passive tree we have flame seeker your hammer of soul will alter its flight path to seek your enemies we got cauterize we have enemies brought down by your fire will regenerate your health and finally we have wildfire enemies brought down by your hammer explode damaging and catching over nearby enemies on fire anyways guys this is really it for this video if you made it this far make sure you drop a like on the video if you want to see the other subclasses for the warlock and the hunter make sure you drop a like let me in the comment section below anyways guys hopefully you guys did enjoy if you can please leave a like if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe and i'll see you guys later peace